Hello and welcome to another reading. So today's reading is what you can expect to unfold in the next week. And the two cards for today is the Four of Wands and we also have the Queen of Swords reversed. So I can see a celebration is coming up for you. Um, it could be some kind of milestone for some of you. It's like an anniversary or a birthday. And for others, it's just like a get together with your family and friends of celebration. But what's happening with the Queen of Swords coming up here is that what's wanting to happen is for you to celebrate more, okay? For you to celebrate your wins and celebrate, you know, the times that you've actually had success, right? In all those little moments, because the Queen of Swords reverse reminds us that we might be using too much of our logic mind. And what's wanting to happen for you, and the message here is to open your heart and actually lead you from your heart. Let yourself be guided through your heart rather than your logic and your mind, right? Sometimes we might have a tendency to be too much in our head. So what's wanting to happen for you to deepen this aspect is to celebrate your wins, no matter how small they are or how insignificant they may seem. You know, a win could be simply getting up out of bed. Uh, a win for you might be that you you know you you went out and got a, you did a walk or you did some exercise you got some movement or you managed to you know get some more of your book written whatever it is for you celebrate that success because being in the head too much you know the queen of souls reverse reminds us that when you know we're in our heads too much we miss out on this success and we focus more on what we haven't done so if you find yourself focusing on those aspects celebrate your wins your friends and family want to celebrate with you and you know it's time that you really focus on this and the more you do that the more energy that you give to those celebrations and the success the more you're going to create that energy within your life so for the next week I would suggest writing down, journaling, or just at least spending time to think about all the times that you've succeeded, no matter how big or small. So I hope this resonates. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe for more and comment down below to claim it. Thanks guys. See you in the next video.